Hey everybody, Rails Matter here. Welcome to episode two of my Walking Dead, the final season. Let's play. This is Suffer the Children. I know I am so late in getting this episode out. First of all, I wanted to make sure that they were actually going to continue the rest of the season. I didn't want to just end it on episode two and have it be a cliffhanger. But obviously it's now confirmed that they're going to finish the season. Uh, no news yet as of today, November the 8th, on when they are going to be releasing episode 3. It was supposed to come out November 6th, but of course with everything that happened with Telltale. Uh, as of uh, today, there's still no news yet on when episode 3 is coming out, but I wanted to just sit down and play it. I've been away from this game for too long, so I hope you guys are excited to uh, continue on with uh, this Let's Play. Let's get into it. Previously on The Walking Dead, AJ and I had been searching for a long time for some place we could call home. Just when we thought we'd found a huge stash of food, it turned out to be a trap. That could have been the end. But I woke up and found I'd been saved by a guy named Marlin. The leader of a community, living inside an old boarding school. It felt like a chance at having a home. A real one. We had to go back to the train station to see if any food survived the explosion. But someone else had the same idea. When AJ distracted him, I shoved him into a pack of walkers. I found Marlin and Brody in the basement that night, arguing about the man we'd seen, and I learned why Brody was so afraid. The man was part of a group of raiders they'd run into a year ago. Marlin traded Tennessee's older sisters to the raiders to keep himself safe. He attacked Brody and locked me in the basement with her. When she turned, I had to stop her. Marlin stole AJ's gun and tried to convince them I had murdered Brody. Lewis backed me up. With everyone against him, the fight went out of Marlin. I told him to leave and never come back. But then... Marlin was dead. And AJ pulled the trigger. He remembered what I'd taught him. To always aim for the head. It's good to get back into this game again. I missed it. I'm so happy it's gonna finish. <laughs> Even Clementine seems a little coffee. bit afraid of AJ. She's just like, oh god. It was in the kitchen. Tin said that I can have some. I didn't steal it. I don't think anyone is gonna say no to AJ knowing what he's capable of now. <sighs> I'm surprised you remember how to make it. We haven't had coffee in a long time. You put it in hot water. You're right. Thanks. <laughs> Last night, with Marlin, I heard Lewis and, and what he called me. Wait, what did Lewis call him? Oh boy, I can't remember. Did he call Am him? I a murderer? I mean, technically, yes. No! Oh my god! Shit! We could get medicine from the nurse's office. He's dead. The kid blew his brains out. You shot him. He's dead. You're a murderer. You promised Marlin. You said you'd help him fix things. What the fuck did you teach this kid? Lewis called me a murderer. But... But we're supposed to kill bad stuff. Monsters. Did I do it bad? Oh, I thought Marlin was bad. 
No. He killed Brody. Oh, no. he, he kept telling lies. Oh god, I'm just gonna stay silent. None of those Clem? answers seem right to me. Please just tell me. I'm sorry. Oh, this, this is if tough I'm right off the bat. I, I should know. Right? So... So that I can try not to be your... Oh god, I'll say it was murder. This will be hard to hear. Lewis was right. It's technically Sometimes true. Sometimes people do bad things, like Marlin did. But when you shot him, he wasn't a threat to us anymore. That is true. He had given if up at that point. If you kill someone when they're no longer threatening you, that's murder. And he Even did shoot him bad? in the back of the head, so Even he had then, no way to defend himself. It was wrong. Oh god, what that was... What are we gonna do? That was tough. That was tough. I'm so sorry, AJ. I mean, you told me to be honest. Well, now things are Back very off. awkward. All of you. <laughs> it was under control! Thank you, Violet. I talked Marlin down. Then he murdered my fucking friend. Take AJ, go inside. Come on, let's go. Oh, just let them go back to the dorms? What happens the next time one of us does something this kid doesn't like? Should we expect a bullet too? That's not what happened. It's exactly what happened. Oh boy. It was over. The little Mr. Trigger Happy decided otherwise. Marlon started this. He killed Brody and almost got me too. AJ did what he had to do. <laughs> I'm what like, he had to? I'm saying two he different didn't have things. He to shoot Marlon <laughs> in the fucking skull. It was over. Get it, Lewis. Just back off, okay? Back off? Seriously? All right, Violet is best girl. <laughs> Clem, Clem. I think it's safe to say my relationship, whatever if I'm a murderer, budgeting and relationship I, I had with Lewis is what? done. No. Well, I think murderers are like monsters, and I know what happens to monsters. Nothing good. Nothing good at all. We can forgive them. Murderers, even some monsters, they get a second chance. I, Some monsters. I feel bad. Not all. I'm basically calling AJ a when monster. When bad people, like murderers, try to make it right, that's when other people forgive them. That sounds hard. It is. We're going to fix this. You and me. I'm going to help you atone. Atone? It means make up for what you did wrong. We'll make it all right with the others. <laughs> For God's sake, someone help me with this! <laughs> Save you from that car wreck, and you fucking murdered him? Get back, Mitch. Get back. Or what? You're gonna let him kill me too? Then who's next? A Sim? Willie? Haven't enough people died tonight? Brody, Marlin, we can't keep killing each other. Oh, fuck, are you saying that to me after what he did? Yeah, I was like, that sounds a little hypocritical where I'm like, yeah. Screw both. We're allowed to have some murders, but not you. Oh boy, this is gonna be tough. Damn, AJ, you've gotta make hey, everything difficult. What is it? You've killed a lot of people. You murdered your friend Lee, didn't you? Wow, what? AJ, wow. You said he was handcuffed. He wasn't a threat. Damn, throwing that back in my face. So, that means you murdered him. Oh god, I'm just gonna sound like such a hypocrite. I killed him because I loved him. I didn't want him to suffer. How? He'd be dead. He would have turned. I didn't want that for him. He deserved better. Oh god, what if me saying this? What if Clementine gets in the exact same position and what I, I just you, said... Aw, is gonna like... You know, AJ's gonna, you back. gonna make that... Have to make that same choice. Please don't let it end like that where it ends with... Her getting bit, and then he has to make the decision to kill her or let her turn into a walker. I don't think my heart could handle that. Hey. Violet said to come get you for the funeral. So I'm wondering, really? if it had been the other way we around... used to have them more. Then we if, stopped. Uh, if I had Violet seems be right the one though. to defend me, if she would have been the one... I brought you something. ...who was yelling at me for, for killing me? Marlin. I figured you'd be afraid. With everyone all upset. So, in that case, I'm glad that but I chose you Lewis were brave last night. to help me, because I like, like Violet more. <laughs> no. Firefighters are good. I'm a murderer. No, you're not. 
You gotta have a trial first. Oh, jeez, a trial? They decide that stuff in a courtroom. That's how it works. Er, worked. Before. Back then, there were all kinds of rules about who was innocent, who was guilty. It was complicated. We have to decide things for ourselves now. We can't rely on other people to make the rules for us. Who decided you're a murderer? Clem. <laughs> but she's right. So Damn, I sound else. like a bitch. <laughs> I think you're okay. I like this kid. You sure you don't want your firefighter? I hope his sister is still keep alive. Because you're good, like him. But maybe we could play with him later? Together? Sure. Aww. After the funeral. Oh, they buried them already. Vile started soon. That means that this little kid's probably gonna die. See you out there. All the good ones go. That's how this works. I'm glad that AJ didn't <sighs> this lose is gonna his be friend. Hard. Everyone's going to be upset. We need to show them we care. Okay? Okay. All right, back into the gameplay now. <laughs> Gotta have some of that hot bean juice to get me through this. This is gonna be so awkward, AJ. You don't even understand. Is there they look good together. Do you think his is better? No, I like them both. <laughs> oh boy. Oh yeah, that's right. You can collect things <laughs> Still too. Still cool. I gotta try and be better about picking things up. I know there's a couple that I missed from before. Alright. On that note, is there anything I have missed here? I've already looked at that. Alright, let's talk to AJ and then we'll get going. We'll just get this over with like ripping Time off a band-aid. Soon. <laughs> wow, that was a pointless thing for me to do. Alright, let's get going. Ready? Oh, murder mom and her little murder child are just gonna be sticking together. I Like I said, I am so happy that at first I was like, why did I choose Lewis to, you know, defend me? But if it had turned away the other, the other way, and if it had been Violet yelling at me, I could understand, like, I mean, I would have been so much more upset if Violet was angry at me than Lewis, because I like Violet more. And I know, um, in the last episode, like, I got a little bit of crap because, you know, I was like, oh, Lewis, you pussy, why didn't you defend me? And it's like, well, Marlin is his best friend, so he does have a little bit more, well, a lot more loyalty to someone he's known most of his life rather than some girl he literally just met, even if he does have a crush on her, but I don't think that's happening anymore, I think. Any feelings he had for her are probably gone. Oh. Oh, what about the dog? Where's the dog? Can I get the dog now? I did that. Come on. <laughs> like, I'm just delaying it as much as possible if I can just, like, squeeze into that funeral in the last, like, minute or so so I don't have to deal with the awkwardness of it. That would be great. I don't know how much more there is to look around. Let's... Uh, let's just do this. Oh, there's the doggo. I can't remember what... Rosie. That's what her name was. I'm terrible at remembering people names, but I will remember dog names. <laughs> oh, don't even, sweetie. Oh, God. They're here. So what? They knew Brody, didn't they? Yeah, but Marlin... Just leave them alone. Thank you, Violet. <sighs> Shit. Clem? What? <clears throat> Why do people have funerals? Tim said they used to have them more. They died. But I don't get it. Well, to say goodbye to someone you've lost. But they're dead. This is your last chance to see them before they're gone forever. I made them all sad. Like if someone took you away. Oh, I don't like all this potential foreshadowing. People do. Some animals, too. 
Whatever she sees. See the monsters? Merlin did bad things, but he wasn't a monster. I know. Ten. You ready? Brody, you always said you wanted to go to the beach. So, I drew it. I said, this is gonna be weird for Ten knowing that Marlin basically gave his sisters up. He's probably gonna have some not Marlin so great feelings was... about him. I can't. Not for Marlin. After what he did to the twins and Brody, I... You didn't even like Brody! You were always mean to her. I can't. Someone else do it. Bitch. Wow. Dude, don't. Seriously, Lewis. He was your best friend. It wasn't oh. perfect, but he deserved better than to get gunned down by that Looks kid. Looks like Lewis Mitch is having... killed him like it was nothing. You're right, Mitch. Looks like Lewis is having some, uh, AJ second feelings. I know what I did. Second thoughts about... I'm sorry. About AJ. I know I'm a murderer, but I'm gonna, uh... Uh... Atone. Yeah, atone it. Fuck, I can't listen to this. What I did was bad, and I'm gonna make it up to you. I promise. You don't have to make up shit. Marlin was a fucking murderer and a liar, and if we'd all asked more questions about Minnie and Sophie disappearing last year, oh, yeah, none of right. this would have happened. That's right, She's Violet got a point. had the Shut relationship up. with one of them. It wasn't Marlin's fault. Then whose fault was it? Whatever happened before, AJ shouldn't have killed Marlin. Yeah, he wasn't hurting anybody when I killed him. See what I mean? How can any of us trust these fucking people? What are you saying? What is he like? I'm saying they got a fucking Every go. choice I make is the wrong Take one. Take a vote. Majority decides. They stay or they leave. Today. Oh, that crap. does seem fair. Are you serious? It's bullshit. I don't want to leave. But if you all decide we should, we'll go. I'm gonna Wait, try and... You heard her, kid. A vote's the only way to settle this, and we'll be try and forever. be, like, diplomatic Fine. about this. I guess we're fucking voting. Lewis needs to vote. Could you go get him? And try to talk to him. Come on, Rosie. Oh, Come here, girl. Oh, no, to Rosie. Okay, safe to say I don't think Rosie will be my new dog. <laughs> oh, boy. Could you guys go wait in the dorm? I'll come get you. I am very curious about, like, if the, you know, the choice to have Violet stick up for you or not uh, at the end of the last one. Like, she seems to Please be pretty don't kick us out. mindset about hating Marlin regardless. Come on, let's go. So maybe in her eyes it wouldn't have mattered if uh, if she'd been the one to have to defend us or not, because uh, her mind seems pretty made up. That's right, because I forgot that Marlin basically sacrifice her girlfriend. I forgot all about that. Oh, she having flashbacks right now. <gasps> AJ, stop! You'll break your toe or something. I was like, that was getting pretty annoying. <laughs> Come here, sit down. No! It, it didn't work! I did what you said and they didn't even care. I know that I was bad, but but they don't want to let me fix it. AJ, breathe. Remember what we do when we're mad? <clears throat> Come on. I don't want to be loud, do you? What do we do when we're mad? We stop and think and, um... Oh, Clem's such a good mom. I'm still really, really mad. I know that I'm not supposed to get mad or sad, because then I do dumb things. And you have every reason to be upset. We'll deal with it together, okay? Okay. We I'm stop, <laughs> we think. I'm so bad at giving we him conflicting breathe. information. Breathe. <sighs> if 
feel better? <laughs> no. You're still mad, huh? <laughs> and, uh... I think I'm sad, too. Aww. My little murder baby. Aww. I did what you told me to. I know. You're a good listener. I wanted to make them all feel better. It didn't work. Why'd you tell me to do that if it didn't work? I have to remember, he's just a kid and he he still thinks the world in, like, black and white. I'm not gonna say don't give up yet. We don't know that it didn't work. They might have voted for us to stay. I don't know. They seem pretty mad. Violet was on our side. Maybe she'll persuade the others. Yeah, maybe. I don't want to go. <sighs> I know you don't. I like knowing where we are all the time. The bed, the food. I like the other kids. Not all of them, but Tin and Lewis and Violet. And I was like, Lewis doesn't really like you right now, though I'm sorry to say, but I feel like Lewis could be turned. I feel like he just needs to work things out and maybe he'll understand. Uh -oh. We took the vote. Oh, you have dang. to leave. Shit, okay, well. Don't we get to vote? I vote that we stay. That's not how it works. Maybe it should be. You don't have to like it. Good, because I don't. Fine, I get it. We'll learn to live with your decision somehow. Seriously? That's it? You know this is fucking wrong, and you're not gonna fight it at all? What's the point? You've already decided. Yes, we have. I know this isn't like Clementine to just give up like this, but I feel like, uh, arguing so with them stupid. You isn't said going go to make things better. If we voted fairly. It's bullshit. And you'd know it if you weren't so used to burying your head in the sand. Oh, I'm burying my head in the sand? Hate Marlin all you want, but you can't tell me AJ isn't dangerous too. I know Violet's gonna do something. She's not gonna let we'll wait this. for you to pack up, then Lewis and I'll escort you out past the safe zone. This isn't gonna be how we'll it ends. Sure Come on, something's gonna happen. Something's gonna happen. It's not a lot, but at least you won't die on the way. I'll try. I'm we gonna try. Could have happily dumped you outside the gates. I'm still trying to be Thanks diplomatic for about sure it. sure that we. <laughs> no, don't thank them. It's it's their fault. We gotta leave. They're gonna get rid of us. Get him under control. AJ, breathe. <sighs> Where's Tin? I gotta say goodbye. He was really upset about the vote, and he's not talking to anybody. It's best to leave him alone when he's like this, but for the record, he wanted you to stay. Oh, I know that. I don't doubt that at all. Wait. Cut. Does AJ still have that gun? Oh, come on. You're gonna give up the gun? Like, no, we're leaving. You can't take his gun. If you're gonna, like... Oh, is he gonna say maybe if he doesn't have a gun, he gets Hand to it stay? Over. I think that's fair. Is this necessary? Hell yes, it's necessary. Yeah. May I'm I not walking out into the woods with him holding that thing. Oh, crap. Give it to him. Oh, no. Here, you can have it. Oh, no, I was thinking, like, maybe... Maybe Lewis would be like, well, if he doesn't have a gun on him, then Fuck. he's not... There. Happy? <sighs> he's, he's not a threat to anybody. <clears throat> but by giving up AJ's gun, I might have just put AJ in danger. Shit. All right, I'm taking the cat skull, though. Come on. <laughs> I'm taking all this shit. I'm taking it. And the hat, of course. Gotta take the hat. No, my cat skull. And my pictures. The medicine, at least. Take the bandages and everything. Ah, oh, jeez. I know there's gonna be someone... Like, Lewis definitely seems to be wrestling with... With something like I think he's gonna change his mind they're gonna something's gonna happen they're gonna save us and they're gonna convince everyone to let us stay this isn't gonna be the end of it we just got here
Lewis will definitely give AJ his gun back. Will we get another car? Probably not. We got lucky before. So we're walking. My shoes are gonna break. Well, we'll have to hope they hold out. My feet are gonna bleed again. We'll tear up a shirt and tie them up if we have to. It's not so bad. <laughs> She's like, shut the fuck up. I mean, you've done this before. <laughs> Violet's like, shut the fuck Probably up. Probably pretty good at it by now. Almost like going home for you guys. Don't pretend you give a shit. I'm gonna- now I'm gonna be snarky. I've been trying to be nice this whole time. I'm gonna- I'm gonna let loose some of that clem sass. We're here. The road's that way. Anything you want to say before we go? Eh, not really. <laughs> I've said plenty. Thanks for trying to keep us. You're welcome. I wish you could stay. I didn't want this. Come on, let's just go. Give us a minute. You didn't help you... much, wow. Yeah, so do I. I wish we hadn't fucked it up. Oh, damn. You didn't. Marlon did. Even dead, he's still ruining shit. Jesus, Violet. Give him some fucking peace. Just stay safe. Both of you. I must be stupid. What is the? Oh, what are I you doing? I can't leave you out here unarmed. I knew he was gonna give the gun back. Well, thanks. Lewis, we could have had something, man. To go throw it all away. Let's get going. The sun will set soon. How do you know? I don't know. I can just feel it. How? Like AJ, There's don't this cold that settles on my skin. Don't even get into it. Happens it. <laughs> right before a storm too. I don't feel that. <laughs> you haven't been on the road as long as me. Clem. Hmm. Will we be okay? I thought we were done running from all the bad people. Yeah, of course we'll be okay. We're used to this. I hate it out here. I can't imagine I how could go back. depressing it would be to finally yeah, have, so like, do I. a place that felt safe and then you're just dumped back. Oh, Jesus! Hi. Oh my god. That was really loud. Whoa. Well, things, uh, never... <laughs> Never quiet for long, right? Nope. Now come on out. I saw a couple of you on the road. Wait, oh no, is that the How guy from How long do you think you can hide? Oh, shit. That's the man from the train station? Yes. I thought he died. You can survive a bite if you cut it off fast enough. Oh, that makes me Whoa. so upset that Lee Stay didn't here. make it, but this asshole did. Uh, yeah. Oh, geez, there's, okay, there's a two-part one there. Right, quick time events. I'm not used to this. Tough little bitch, aren't you? Oh, boy. Finish him off? I feel like Just that will have away. repercussions. We'll let you go. Oh. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> I wouldn't, boy. Any closer, your friend might get her head blown off. Abel. Good to see you again, Squirt. Oh, jeez, don't! I've seen these ones before. Fighters. Both of them. You'll like them. We're looking for a kid. Runs a community near here. Marlon. <sighs> He's dead. Well, shit. This can still work. How about it? 
You want to take us back to your school? Help us talk to your friends? It's not like you have many other options. It's not my school. I don't live there. I find that very hard to believe. Not a lot of kid communes around here. Ah! Don't! Ah! Let him go! Please! Sure. If you do like we ask. God damn it. Otherwise, I'm happy to crack his head open. Uh... You ever seen old fruit explode after you throw it at something? That's just how it'll look. Uh, uh, Clementine! <gasps> oh shit, it's Lily? I thought her voice sounded familiar. Oh my god. Clementine, it's you? I knew it! I knew it because they were the. I... the... My name is Lily. Yes, because, like, the beginning of the thing. You probably don't remember me. Of the. when they had the decision Lily? about what you did with Lily. I knew she'd come back. I thought you died. I came close. What the hell? Not now. The fuck is this? I said, not now. Okay, I'm gonna be nice to Lily for now. I'll take the help I can get. If I can get on their good sides, maybe I don't have to betray the school. I knew she was coming back. I've been really good about trying with you. to uh, avoid, like, spoilers. So he's dead then. I'll never forget him leaving me on the side of the road to die. Yeah, well, you know what? I was a kid. That was not my decision. I don't blame him. I was clearly a threat to the group after I shot that girl. Carly. That's right, Carly. Lee should have left you behind, too. Might have lived longer if he did. Wow, okay, Lily, just a... Same thing will happen to you, if you repeat his mistakes. Just as much of a bitch as I Your remember. little boy there. You'll die protecting him. You may be able to keep this up a while longer, but eventually he'll slow you down. Oh, should a I say you'll you die first? Spot. A bullet you couldn't dodge. A desperate cry for help that brings the herd. I don't think so. AJ knows how to handle himself. He's got spirit, I'll give you that. But you and I know that won't be enough. Fuck, we don't have time for all this. And we she got turned history. quick. Great. She went you from like, her, oh, her. Point let is, me help you up to, to like... We can help you raise that boy, behind. Clementine. Wow. But we need you to do something for us. <laughs> what? Help you kidnap a couple more kids? We don't need a couple. We need all of you. We'll take you back to the Delta to join our people. We have walls, we have working solar panels, and we grow our own food. All we need from you is to go back to your friends and convince them to come peacefully. No one will be harmed. I'm not Marlin. Here's what I'll do. I'll take a little squirt here right now. <clears throat> that way, I'm sure yes. you'll play nice. Yes. Be smart about this, Clementine. It's an us or them kind of world, Clem. If you want to save your little one, you won't pick them. Run! I don't know why I did that. They totally could have shot Lily, but I'm trying to... I'm trying to let them know that I'm on their side. Yes, with that kick. Come on! Man, that kick has served her so well. Oh, god damn it, AJ. I don't know what a difference would have been if I had told them to shoot Lily. But I figured this way maybe they can get back and warn the others about what's about to happen and everyone can be ready. Because it's just the two of them, right? Two of them versus all those kids? X. I'm not used to, uh, to the Xbox controller. Uh, I don't know which way I'm going. Oh crap, where's, where's AJ? Where's AJ? Did he run ahead of me? I don't know if I lost her or if he's just really fast. Oh, there he is, okay. Oh shit. Oh god damn it. Gotta do some dodging action here. Go! Oh. oh shoot. Did I not do it right? Uh oh. Damn, 
Clementine, you are so badass. <laughs> Clem. Oh, damn. Oh, shit. It's just like Lily said, he's gonna slow me down, but I don't care. I'll never- I am never gonna give up AJ. I- I will have Clementine die rather than that. As tough as that might sound, like, I am going to defend AJ. Oh jeez, I hate this. Oh no. Okay. Oh crap, I gotta defend AJ too. Shit, AJ's right there. This is terrifying, actually. Just like, I can hear the zombies. I can hear the walkers. But I don't know where they're coming. Oh, jeez. Okay, there they are. Alright. Come on, come on. Clem, 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 clem. Stun, stun, and kill. And kill. Okay. Whew. Whew. That was intense. That was intense. It's not over yet. It's not over yet. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Why, 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 why? Oh my god. I hate this. Oh god. Oh, why, 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 He's gonna get me, he's gonna get me. Oh no. Shit. Oh, damn. I'm really not good at, uh, at this. Alright, let's just kill him right now. Okay, no more of this thing where I, uh, what's the word? I'm just gonna kill them. I'm not gonna worry about stunning them. I just, just go. Just go. I don't have time. Ain't nobody got time for that. Just go. Oh jeez, come on, why, 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 why? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oof. Please, no more. Just, I just want to go. Oh, you're gonna keep making me do this, and there's just more and more. Oh god, I. This is my least favorite part. Okay, this guy's fast. Oh jeez, that's. Oh, what? Stop. What? Too loud. Oh shit. I thought he was kind of stumbling quickly. Whoa. Whoa, that was weird. Damn, dude. You're doing the, uh... Oh, shoot, what's her name? Jane. Doing the Jane method, but he's really going method acting with it. I still don't understand all, all the times that Clementine, she knows about covering, you know, yourselves in guts and stuff. Why doesn't she just do that all the time? Like, I understand there's a risk of, like, infection of getting, like, blood if you have any cuts or anything, but man, like, she should be doing that as much as possible. Wow, that was intense. It's pretty sad that of all these people, the dude dressed up like a zombie is the one that I'm trusting the most right now. There. Oh, rough. <laughs> As I say, oh, oh, get oh. the shrapnel out. Oh no, me? I'll keep him still. I was gonna say, Clementine, you've stitched up your own arm before. I know this is tough, but come on, I know you can do it. Oh, with the knife. Oh, this is gonna be. Oh God, this is gonna be uncomfortable. Oh no, I'm so sorry, AJ. Oh, oh. oh. 
<sighs> oh god. This is, this is like her stitching up her armor. It's in like really disgusting detail. I don't know if doing it fast or slow makes a difference, but I'm trying to do it slow so I don't risk, you know, doing it too forcefully. Ugh. Trying not to be loud. It's okay, AJ. Just breathe. Put your hands there. Stop the bleeding. It's okay, AJ. She's just gonna patch you up. Oh. Oh, with duct tape? Oh. It's enough. For now. Well, Clementine, if you had grabbed the med kit from your room, it would... <laughs> Maybe you'd be in a better position right now. Oh, easy, easy. Where's our stuff? My gun. We lost it, buddy. Lewis and Violet ran. They're safe. Yeah, probably. Now, if that doesn't convince Lewis that we are to be trusted, I don't know what Shit. will. Okay, I want to know what this guy's deal is. Did he own, like, a costume shop or something? And he's- that's where he's got his mask from? Like, what is his- he is so interesting. I didn't mean to endanger you. The walkers were sent to help you. You sent the walkers? Was part of a group. Call themselves Whisperers. They've learned to live in herds, among walkers. Move among them. Whisperers. Sometimes. I wonder if, guide that, them. if that's been brought up in the show before. It sounds vaguely familiar. Or in the comics. Why are you alone, if you were part of a group? They attacked a community. Saw the carnage. Didn't want to be part of it. Does it hurt? <laughs> Hungry. Eat. Both of you. Oh, well, I'm not gonna say no to that. Thank you. Do you have a name? Been a while. Sense. I've said it. Is he gonna be someone that I know as well, or...? Oh! James. I thought he was like an old dude. Why did you help us, James? I was like, forget about Louis Clementine, the I think... people who attacked you. What do you know about If that? I can trust him, he might be a suitable... <laughs> Companion? I know they steal kids. They took two last year. A common practice for them. They're at war up north. Their entire community against another. It's why they take people. To make them fight. Train them. Use them. You would join their war. That's horrible. Yes. That's why I helped you. Thank you. Dude looks like he stepped right out of a boy band. <laughs> Wait. Throw it. Distract him. Works just as well. And Although, nobody gets hurt. She's probably her and Not him. us. They're Not probably him. going to have a little bit of disagreements about how to deal with walkers. It's like he almost thinks of the walkers as his friends. So maybe, never mind Clementine, maybe James isn't a Thank good, you. <laughs> like, person to uh, get in a relationship with. Go for Violet instead. I don't know if Lewis is, uh, is worth it. And this guy's a little weird. Safe. It was difficult to send the herd in to save you. I didn't want them to die. Yeah, she's like, okay. Hey. 
So, James, do you just hang around in the woods, saving random people? After I left my group, I wandered. First time alone, ever. Saw war everywhere. First against walkers, then against each other. Hoped it would be better here. Where are you from? Here? Or somewhere far away? Georgia. Long way from home. It feels like forever ago. It was. So, where are you from? Washington. Oh, interesting. The city or the state? The city. Dad ran a food truck. I helped. He is definitely one of the more interesting characters that I've met so far. You've got a fever. His wound will need proper cleaning and medicine, if you're lucky enough to have any. The school has medicine, but I don't think they'll share it. That's why those people attacked you, isn't it? To get to that school. Like I said, They'll After destroy whatever they find. I saved Violet and Lewis. More guns. So hopefully more fighters. they'll convince the other people to Take like Take everyone me. inside. They won't be able to fight them off. You need medicine. You have to go back, or you'll lose him. <sighs> I'll go back. Convince them to help AJ. This is gonna be tough. Like, They'll yeah. They'll take us back once they see him. They wouldn't turn AJ away. I don't know, Clementine. I don't know. I was gonna say, you it's like... They sent you guys out pretty I'll harshly. help you get back. So. Past the walkers. A few more hours and we'll go. That's a few hours for you to sleep. <sighs> I'll stay awake. You don't have to. This guy almost seems too nice. I don't know. Sleep. I'll keep watch. <sighs> okay, I will. What about you? Don't need it. Not tonight. Rest well. Good night. Like, I know he's a little weird, because he thinks the zombies are his friend, and like, whenever a character seems too nice, you always feel like there's something about them that's, you know, you gotta be wary about. So hopefully he doesn't have some sort of weird ulterior motives. Because like I said, he's kind of strange, but I like him. I mean, he was willing to help Clementine out without really seeming to want anything in return, so that's cool. Is he awake? Yeah. He's so hot. I can carry him. You're exhausted. No, I've got him. Oh, we're almost there. Please don't make me have to fight zombies while I've got AJ. We're so close. It's that whole thing like Lily keeps saying about how it's just, you know, he's gonna drag you down. She sounds a lot like Jane in that aspect, but... Uh, hurt. Hold on. We're almost there. I don't even think Jane would be that harsh as to be like, you need to leave the kid behind. Walker! Oh! Violet! Lewis! They came back! Hey, you might want to take off the mask, my dude. <laughs> Look, you live out there alone, right? You could stay with us. She's like, that's assuming that they're gonna let you back in, Clementine. <laughs> She's being very hopeful. Not ready. <laughs> it's just so weird being like, if someone who looks like a zombie just strut away completely <sighs> casually. 
I can't keep carrying you. We'll be inside soon. Rest now. Oh, Lewis, don't even. Like, don't give me attitude. I saved your asses. <laughs> Shit. Is he... Uh... He's alive. He was shot. He's got a fever. Come on, let's get him inside. I was say like, shot I by can't. the people I saved you guys from. It's okay, buddy. I got you. Alright, Lewis, you're cool, I guess. I still like Violet better. So they had to realize too the fact that they were trying to convince us to raid the school and Let me we see. didn't agree to it. So maybe that turned them on realizing. Well, I have what I need people. upstairs. Come on. We got the shrapnel out of him. We? It's a long story. He's running a fever. Body's trying to fight infection, poor little guy. Ruby and Lewis will take care of him. You come with me. We can talk in the office. Clem? Shh. You just try to rest, okay? We're gonna fix you right up. Clem! AJ, listen to Ruby, okay? She'll look after you. He's like, they kicked us out. <laughs> like Come a on. day ago. What do we do when we're scared? When fear starts to get the upper hand. We breathe. We breathe in. Hold it in. <sighs> I was tempted I'm to say, now. we tell it to fuck off, but... Uh, I'm, I'm trying to curb the swearing a little bit. Clementine, please. We need to talk. Happened out in the woods. I saw they had you pinned, and I. Shit, I got so crazy. I was like, what's up, Clementine? So upset. When I heard you call for help, I didn't even think. I wanted to help you, but when you told us to run, I had to trust you. Thank you for protecting us. It was really brave. I really thought you were dead, Clem. It's just everything is so fucked right now. I'm not gonna say you know? any of those bad things. It's Violet's really been on our side again. from the outset. It's good to see you too. Why would I call her an asshole? She did everything Swish, she could to the try and protect the same. us. Lewis and I told them what happened in the woods. That woman who attacked you, Lily. So you do know her. We were wondering. So I gotta explain my whole thing about how I know Lily. Who the hell is she? I mean, I know you're not like with her group. But the others don't like the coincidence. Her showing up right after you? I mean, I wouldn't have recognized her if she hadn't recognized me first. We were in a group together. A long time ago. Hope it was a different kind of group that didn't fucking steal people. Come on, you know it was different. Come on, Clementine, you can explain a little she bit more. She murdered than someone that. in our group, gunned them down during an argument. Carly was her name. She refused to let Lily push her around. It was right at the start. I haven't seen Lily since. I believe you. But? There's something else. Lily said someone was with you at the gates. James. He saved me and AJ. Let us stay in his camp for the night. But why did you bring him here? You led him right to us. I mean, he's a stranger, Clem. Running into those two in the woods, it proved we can't trust anybody. Look, he's not with the raiders. He lives by himself in the woods. I, I hope- Lily said he was wearing- I don't know. I want to believe Animal that. skins or something? I want to believe James is good. He was wearing walker skin. That's how he gets past herds. He can guide oh, them too. Oh, it's walker skin. I thought it was like... <sighs> wow. Like a zombie mask. Okay. <laughs> I wouldn't have brought him here if I thought he was a threat. It's not that I don't trust you. I'm just worried about the others and what they might do. 
They didn't even get a chance to mourn Brody and Marlin before these child-snatching assholes showed up. And then you two come back after we thought you were dead. Now they're confused and no one knows how to feel about AJ. Violet, AJ is the least of their worries. I know, but everything is such a mess. They're scared and angry and they're looking for someone to blame. I mean, they kicked you out. How am I supposed to make them change oh, their so minds Oh, so I guess she's like you? the de facto leader? It was leader decided. Like? Five to three against. I know it feels like it shouldn't matter, but they were afraid of you. Both of you. You're sitting in Marlin's chair, aren't you? You're their leader now. They'll listen to you. They don't, though. They only listen when they want to. Well, they'll have to start if they want to survive what's coming. I guess I gotta be tougher now with Clementine. I, James I just, told like, me what Lily and Abel will do next. I was trying to he be said diplomatic get before. More people and guns and now come attack us. Take everyone here. How the hell would he know? He's watched them for a while. They're at war with another community. They take people to fight for them. Is that what happened to Minnie and Sophie? They turn them into soldiers? Yeah, it'll happen to us too if we don't stop them. Minnie didn't even like killing walkers. Look at this place. It's a fortress. With a little work, we could make this place really hard to attack. Do you actually know how to do that? Yeah, I was part of a siege once in a town called Richmond. Here, let me show you. What? Oh, okay. I was like, does she have, like, the stuff from Richmond? Okay. Plan your defenses. Oh, can I only choose one, or... Can, or am I just going over all of them? Let's just pick. We've got good, strong walls. We need to make them hard to climb over, so the raiders have to come in through the gates. We used to keep barbed wire in the greenhouse. The courtyard's pretty wide open, not a lot of cover. We should flip the picnic tables, narrow down the pathways through it, so we'll know which way they're coming. At the very least, it'll give us protection if they get past these walls. Look at you, Clementine. You're like a soul. Like she is like a general. This is where we should make our stand. This is how Clementine there's only stays one in. Way in. She makes front, herself indispensable. And then there's the big central staircase. If we rig that path with traps, we can pull back here. Luring in our attackers. I like it. Yep. Uh, over here. Well, you guys don't use the greenhouse anymore, do you? No, we used to. Then we lost someone out there. Walkers overran the place, and Marlin wouldn't let us go back. <laughs> Safe zone. We need to get that barbed wire, so they can't climb the walls. I'll go. Are you sure? It's gonna be swarming with oh, walkers by yay, now. Hey, what the hell's going on? To Lily told me she was back, but I was like, no way! Violet wouldn't just go against what we all decided. Shh! Would you keep it down? The little boy's asleep! His fever's already going down, Clem. He's gonna be okay. Great. We're just giving them our medicine, too? You're a little Mitch. dick. Mitch. Those raiders are getting ready to attack the school. We need Clem's help. Like hell we do. For all we know, she's one of them. She's not. If you saw their leader's boot on Clem's neck, you'd know that. These raiders all carry guns, and they know how to use them. So whatever you think of me and AJ, deal with it. Or you're gonna end up dead. I'd rather take my chances. Clem's going to the greenhouse to find barbed wire and anything else she thinks we need for the fight, and you're going to help her. Oh, uh, man. No, I'm not. Why are you sticking yes, me with Yes, you me? are. It's too dangerous for her to go by herself, and you're good in a fight. I can go too. You know, to keep the peace. This girl's gonna die. I know she's Fuck, gonna die. Vi. Since when are you the one making the calls? <gasps> since no one else stepped the fuck up. <sighs> These two will meet you at the gate, and you can head to the greenhouse once I've explained the situation. See you there. I'm so sorry, little dude. Oh. There we go, Lewis showing some compassion. Maybe he's not all bad after all. I, I, kn I knew he wasn't bad from the start, I was just giving him a hard time. I understand why he was upset. 
hands. Like they said, they wanted someone to blame. And of course, AJ's the most likely person to put the blame on. Are we gonna have a little heart-to-heart -heart with Lewis? Lewis and Violet have been, like, basically the two people I interact with the most. I wonder if I can have, like, a relationship with either of them. Hmm, that's the case, like, I like Violet more. But I almost feel like her and Clementine are very similar. And I don't know if that would be a good thing or a bad thing. Whereas Lewis is kind of more... A little bit softer, maybe he it wouldn't be a bad person to have it's been. to kind of soften Clem a little bit. How much it's changed. Ah, uh, this ain't budging. You gonna stand there sulking all day? You gonna do something useful? Well, we need that barbed wire. There must be another way in. I can't see shit. Well, there's too much condensation on the inside. Condensation? That's a big word for you. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> it's funny, I've been, I've been playing Danganronpa so much that I want to, like hit the button in order to, like, go into x-ray mode to have things pop up for me, and I'm just like, oh wait, no, I can't do that. I have to actually find things on my own. Like a loser. But I don't want to miss out on the collectibles, because if I can get my room back, then I can add things to my shelf alongside my sweet cat skull. But maybe I'll have to go and get them from inside the, uh, greenhouse. Are you okay? It's been so long since I was here. I used to love this place, but it's so overgrown. I'll be fine. Let's just find a way in. Really? Are you you're standing next to the la I mean, I get it, it's broken, but you can't jump up and grab that. Come on, Mitch. What do you want? Uh Nothing. You're only here because we're desperate, you know, so don't get comfy. If we survive these raiders, you and I are gonna have words. Let's survive first. Can I look at anything over here? Nope. All right. That window. I bet we can get in there. Good spot. Mitch. Come here and give me a boost. No, oh, she's so gonna die. Make her go first. Yeah, make me go first. We send the one we don't mind losing. I don't That's know. An ugly thing to say. I don't know if. Uh, help, right? I don't know if she shouldn't mind sticking she would her neck be out. Great I'll go first. In a fight. I don't mind. We can't lose the medic. Figured you'd fight it. Thanks, Clem. That's right. Cause I'm a good person. I'll leave if one grabs you. Otherwise, we'll come as soon as you give the all clear. I guess we'll know when the door opens. There's so- yep, there's a walker there. There's another one. Oh, fantastic. Fantastic. Just dandy. Whoa, 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 whoa. That was happening a little quicker than I was expecting. Hi. Okay, if it's just two, that's not so bad. I'm fine. Oh, thank God. Yeah, I'm really glad I didn't send Ruby in. Oh, crap. Okay, so there's more. Okay, I'm just gonna go. Just go. Just go. Come on. Oh, jeez. Oh, fuck. Uh, <laughs> whenever they're in the groups, I can never just do it on the first go. I was too cocky. I assumed I would have been able to be quicker. I'm fine. Oh, 
Okay, so if it's just two... Uh, uh, can I run? I can run a little bit. Why, 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 why? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Why, 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 why? Man, she really took her time with those walkers. More walkers! <laughs> Did you get up? Do you hear any walkers? She got them. Calm down. I'm coming! I'll get the door open. I can't believe Ruby volunteered to go in there. Just freaking out. She wasn't even there and she's freaking out. I don't know how she would have dealt with those walkers. She would have died. That's that's what would have happened. Not bad. <laughs> Mitch oh, the look. bitch. Wild ginger. Eastern prickly pear. Jerusalem artichoke. False Solomon seal. Let's find that barbed wire and anything else that might be useful. Why do I have a feeling that there's gonna be a walker hiding out somewhere and it's gonna get Ruby? I actually don't really want Ruby to die. You seem happy. You can only eat the same bland rabbit stew so many times before you go crazy. These herbs are gonna do wonders for morale. You wait and see. Oh, can I get like a little cac- oh my god, that would be the perfect little cactus to put on my- Oh, I'm so mad that I can't put any of these cactuses on my on my bookcase thing. Ah. Cuz I love plants. Like I've got plants all over my apartment, so I'm just like I want to do the same for Clement or liven up her room a little bit. Some mushrooms are edible. <laughs> Probably not edible. <laughs> Yes! Dibs! Oh my god, you are a little bitch. God. So the fact that they're kind of giving these characters, making me hang out with them, means that one of them's probably gonna die and I might have to make a decision. If that's the case, definitely Ruby, because like I said, she is kind of like... She's the medic. And I don't know what the hell Mitch does other than complain, so... I don't know if he would be such a... big loss. Could be a weapon. Or use it to dig a grave. You weren't there when we dug the holes for Marlin and Brody. We had to use cups and bowls. It took forever. Yeah, same, Ruby. Same. Ah, they go on to about collectibles other than the mushroom. Eat mushroom? Should I? Mm. Oh, okay, <coughs> never mind. What? This was for science. <laughs> I maybe should have asked Ruby first. She seems to know, like, which things are and aren't. Did you find anything? What do you think? Edible. Okay, just asking. You know, the barbed wire idea is smart, I'll give you that. Those assholes try and climb our walls, they'll tear their guts out. I kind of like to see that. That's an appropriate face to make, Clem. Alright. Let's pry this open. Since I can't take any of those cute little cacti home. Barbed wire. A lot of it, too. That should keep the raiders from climbing our walls. Hey. We can use these. For what? We can make bombs out of these. Bombs? Are you serious? Totally. It's the kind of stuff I made back home. He used to blow shit up. That's why he's a troubled youth. Guilty. I just need some propane and something to create a spark. And we'll have ourselves a nice little homemade explosive. No, oh, maybe you will be useful for something after, Mi after all, Mitch. Alright, um... So, is there anything that I'm missing here? Oh, something over- oh! Okay. If I remember right, there's a science lab through that door. Maybe there's propane in there. Come there's on, There's gonna be move walkers, this thing. aren't there? I don't know how, considering that it's blocked off, but I bet you there will be walkers and someone's going to death. <laughs>
Okay, let's see what's inside. Oh boy. Oh yeah, oh Jesus! I was like, that... Wow. <laughs> hey Mitch, hey Mitch, you wanna maybe help out a little bit? Rose! What's going on? You alright? We had a scare, that's all. Just stood there and did nothing. Oh no. Oh, is what? that someone she knows? Who was she? Miss Martin. Our nurse at the school. She stayed when all the others left. God. Aww. She looks. Maybe that's where she learned how to take care of people? Oh, that's so sad. Well, let's put her out of her misery. You can barely recognize her. I'm sorry, Ruby. I, is it weird to say that I she looks kind of beautiful as a zombie? Just the fact that she's like got like she used to. flowers and plants all over her. One as day we came out looking for food. Walkers attacked us. Thought we could fight them off, but there were just there were so many. Ms. Martin told us to run, so we did. She taught me how to patch people up. Stitching, local anesthetics, painkillers, fever reducers. I don't think I can take care of her. Would you? I'm sorry. Uh, of course I will. Are you okay? Yeah. Just need a minute. Come on, guys. Help me find that propane and we can get out of here. Jeez, Mitch, be a little more sensitive. God. Oh, let's hope that's the only walker. I don't need another jump scare like that. She's like, nope. <laughs> it's Greek to me. <laughs> yeah, like I said, like that's oddly beautiful in a weird way. It's like she's one with nature. They got the light pooling in. I guess as beautiful as a zombie a lot could to you, be. Huh? She was the only one who stayed. She saw us for what we were. A bunch of kids who no one wanted. She loved us when nobody else did. Like, really loved us. Yeah, I've known people like that. I guess everyone has. Ugh, looks like piss. <laughs> Dare you to drink it? Not in a million years. Wimp. Uh, excuse me, wimp? Where were you when I got attacked by that zombie? You did nothing, you little bitch. Oh, please let me be able to keep that in my room. That is so cool. Yeah, <laughs> she just puts it in her back pocket. <laughs> Where did that go? She doesn't have like a backpack or anything. She just stuffed it in her infinite black hole of a back pocket. Oh, well, I'm happy I got to take a plant home at least. <sighs> Let's hope there's gas in it. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, perfect. Uh, here. Oh, you're finally deciding to help out, huh, Mitch? Thanks. Good find. We got the propane. Now if we could just find something to create a spark. Mm -hmm. You find anything? I actually, I don't know what this is. All right, let's talk to Mitch. You seem I to know a lot about bombs. 
Well, made my first one when I was eight. I like to hear the backstories really? of characters. I blew up the garage. It was awesome. Though, Dad didn't think it was awesome. Dad gave me a chemistry set to keep me from fighting the neighbors. Uh, why would you fight the neighbors? I had a lot of energy. I had to use it somehow. And they didn't like my face. Okay. Alright, so something to create a spark. She's just looking at Miss Martin some more. She's kind of not useful. Oh, there we go. Uh, Mitch, is this useful? Fucking A! I was hoping there'd be one of those. That's an igniter. We can use it to create a spark. It's the last thing we need to blast those motherfuckers to hell. We should get back and tell the others. Not until we bury Miss Martin. Bury her? Why bother? It's a walker. Help me drag it out back. You can burn it. Hey, no. hey. Ms. Martin's the reason we're all alive. Wow, Mitch. Show some compassion. She deserves a proper burial. He was all upset here. about Marlin and everything, and but to the greenhouse she, she won't loved. give Ruby that way the, the same. Have to see her like this. You know. She's been dead for years. There's no point. You know I'm on Ruby's side. She deserves size. a real burial. I'll help you bury her. It's the right thing to do for someone you cared about. Thank you so much. It's not a her. It's a walker. Fine, whatever. I'm not wasting my energy on that thing. Well, especially I'll after what she did for AJ. Yard. It's like the least Back I can the school. do, right? But Ms. Martin loved this place. She'll be happy here. I'll make sure everyone knows you helped me. That you've got a... A good heart. There we go, turn those boats around. <laughs> hey. <laughs> You're gonna die, aren't you, Ruby? You so are. I wonder if whoever I side with I've doomed to be killed. Think it'll be enough? <sighs> Hopefully. And it means Lily and her people won't be able to climb the and walls. It's so weird that I'm at we'll war with Lily. This is so we strange. can plan for that. Because she was Straight actually quite a nice to Clementine. Explosion of death. Assholes won't know what hit him. Whoa, hello. Brought you these. I noticed his shirt got messed up when, you know. Where did you get those? They were tens, back when he got here. Should be about AJ's size. I feel like I'm gonna have a heart to heart he with doing? him right now. Better, his fever's down. Thank you for carrying him in. No problem. So we've got a greenhouse again, and bombs. Mitch's idea. I figured. Violet says we'll start getting this place ready in the morning. Good. They all seem okay with letting you stay. Well, yeah, because I'm awesome. For now, anyway. While we get ready to fight. Yeah, I'm glad. All I've wanted is for them to forgive us. I said they're fine with you being here, at least till the raiders wow, are gone. Wow, Louis, calm That doesn't down. mean they all like you again. Everyone else is okay with us staying. What about you? It's fine. Well, he gets better. No, oh, he's still not completely and on after our that? side. I don't know, Clementine. Clem? Hey, kiddo. How do you feel? Better. Still hurts. I know. Hi, Louis. <laughs> hey, little dude. Awkward. I missed you. Are we friends again? Oh, put him on the spot. Haha. <laughs> Come on, Louis. Just get some sleep, okay? Okay. Guess he's not ready to give him an answer yet. Lewis? I'm sorry that you're hurting and, uh, it's our I'm not fault. gonna say I missed him. It wasn't all you. Marlin, he... I have to remember Marlin was Lewis's Forget best it. friend and he is feeling a lot I of things go. right now. And it is complicated. Just like, you know... AJ believes the world is black and white. I'm I can't, not mad at him anymore. I can't think the same are you? thing. People are complicated. He helped carry me. And he was by my bunk when Ruby gave me stuff. 
I'll get over it. It's it's okay if you're mad. To feel that way. I should have said I was never you're mad. Right. I wasn't. Let's really, get a look but... at the shirts Lewis brought you. Then we'll sleep. It's been a long day. Yeah. James was nice, but I don't like sleeping on the ground. I hope we get Me to see neither. James again. He's just so interesting. I want to know more about him. I am, I have a feeling he'll come back, hopefully to help us and not to betray us. Oh, okay, I get to choose. Disco broccoli. Sports jersey. Science dog. How Hell about he this one? Science dog. It looks like Tin's boots. Oh yeah, I think it's the same character. I was cool. tempted to get the Disco broccoli. Oh, hey, let's see. look! It's Disco broccoli and his friend. Oh, okay, never mind. I think we should get... Come on, you gotta I wish wear you could have seen this cartoon. Me too. Hey, this one's pretty cool. Mm, looks like Marlin's jacket. Eh, definitely not. Hmm, huh. yeah. But it would still look good on you. Well, we're definitely not picking. That was my least favorite one anyway, but we're gonna go with Disco Broccoli. Hmm, this one will work. You can put it on when you feel better, okay? Yeah. Time for sleep. I can't sleep with the light. I'll blow it out in a second. All right, I gotta go check out my new plants. Oh, with a mushroom too? Oh, that's kind of lame. Wonder Where's how long it'll last. Where's my Venus flytrap? Really? Really? Oh, come on, the mushroom, but not the Venus flytrap. There we go. Heck yeah. That's way cooler. All right, I'm satisfied. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let a walker bite. And if it tries... <sighs> bang. Okay. I was just like, I'm so confused right now. Is this some weird kind of fever dream? I don't know how long this has taken them to do, but I'm surprised that, you know, them knowing, like, the Lily's group knowing that we know what's about to happen, that they didn't try and attack earlier before we could get ourselves prepared. I'm kind of glad that, you know, they didn't make us have to go through everything. Oh no. What's this? Uh-oh. AJ? Uh-oh. Oh, uh -oh. oh is the please let this be a dream. Where are I don't you? need to hear baby crying. Oh god, this is. This is a nightmare. Oh god, this is awful. Oh, okay. Yep. <laughs> I want to be like, uh, did Clementine eat that mushroom that was on her, uh, on her bookcase and now she's just tripping balls. Oh, this is like the Max Payne nightmare sequence with the baby. AJ! You just hear it crying. This is so trippy. What the hell? Can I run? Oh, I guess it's kind of like a dream where it's like 
even if you want to run, you can't. Like that's as that's as fast as you can go. It's like you're running through molasses. Yeah, this is like Max Payne. Jeez. Hey, Jay. Oh, thank God. At least I didn't drag it out too much. Whoa. You were having a nightmare. Same one you used to have all the time. About what happened at the ranch. Oh, the ranch. That's right. I'll be okay. That's right. There was a whole Just thing about... I hope they're going to go back and show what happened there. That's right, because he was staying with the guy at the ranch. Hey, what do you have there? Did you have a bad dream, too? You've been having them a lot lately. I feel safer like this, not sleeping. I want to stay up forever. I probably could. Like 18 days, if I tried hard. <laughs> I don't know about that. I've never met anyone who could go more than a few days without sleep. That's not tested, buddy. And I'll be buddy. the first. Because then you'll just be sluggish and... If we and... were in danger, then I would. You would be of no use. Ah! Here, let me help you back to bed. No. You don't have to keep checking on me. You always say, be tough. So I am. You're like five you see, years old. I do strong. have to check up on you, and I buddy. Will. All the time. I raised you to be strong, not stupid. I'm not. <laughs> Shutting people out when they're trying to help you? That's stupid. Harsh words, but sometimes you Please, gotta hear them. Don't call me stupid. Maybe that was a little too harsh. I'm sorry you had to do all the hard work to atone me. <sighs> I'm going to help you more so you don't have to do everything. Where are you going? On patrol. Patrol. <laughs> For danger. Bad people. Monsters. Whatever you have nightmares about. What if you stayed here instead? I was like, maybe having AJ walking around at night if with a knife. If you go back to sleep, I'll stay awake and make sure no with more bad dreams come. With a bunch of people who still aren't too sure about you, maybe that's not a great idea. You can't do that. You're not magic. <laughs> How do you know? Maybe I have magic and never told you. <laughs> no, you don't. I'm just glad I convinced him not to. What is it? Can I... Could I maybe sleep in your bed? Like I did when I was little? Yeah. Come on up. I I'm not scared. Just tired. Makes sense to me. Think you need that? Oh, they're sweet. AJ? What? You're still little. <laughs> yeah, I know. Well, I'm assuming that most people are okay with Clementine now with all the help she's been doing. I am curious about how they feel about AJ. <sighs> you ready to work today, kiddo? Bad dreams always make me more tired. Me too. I slept better in your bed. It's my turn to be lookout. I have other stuff I need to do. What stuff? No, oh, it's always stuff. these two. It's important. God damn it, Lewis. Take this seriously for once in your life. I've been taking this seriously for fucking days. It's like Lily and Almost Kenny, where I have to step so in has everyone. and pick Get sides. Get over yourself.
Hey, I thought Lily and Abel would show up days ago. I wonder why they're holding off. Don't know. All I wanted was more time to prepare, but now this waiting sucks and everyone's on edge. Need my help? Yeah, actually. Could you check on everyone and make sure they're doing shit right? Sure, I'm on it. Thanks, Clem. I should go board up the back hallway, since Lewis isn't gonna do it. Nothing left we can use. Wonder if they ever tried to rebuild it after it burned down. My other problem is, isn't anything over by the graveyard? Oh, is that Rosie sleeping by Marlin's? Oh my god, that is just so heartbreaking. Will she let me pet her? Even though I- well, I didn't kill her master. She has to understand that, right? It's like, Rosie, understand. I had nothing to do with it. Oh, I know, what are you doing baby. Down there, Rosie? I know, baby. Good girl. What did Marlon used to do? <laughs> there you go. She's mine now. <gasps> is she mine? Please. That's all I want from this game is I want... I want a gigantic doggo to spit on Marlin. No, I will not do that. That's awful. I mean, don't get me wrong. Marlin was- I hope it's beautiful where you are, Brody. Not the best, but I wouldn't do that. What if someone walked by and saw me do that? They would think I was such a dick. Except for Violet. Violet would be like, all right, that was pretty cool. I wonder if there's going to be a thing at the end to see the percentage of people who spit on his grave. Ms. Martin, thanks for protecting everyone. Well, it was totally worth it to come out here because I got Rosie out and about. And I got to pet her. If you know, you guys know, if there's an option for me to pet the dog, I will pet the dog. Hey, what are you doing? Mm, test. Gotta see if the bomb will go off. This little thing won't kill anybody. Just gotta see if it'll light. Yeah, it better. Our whole plan rests on that little thing. If they get in, I'll need you to set the bomb off while I distract them. Expect the unexpected. Yeah, something like that. I, I read that on one of those stupid inspirational posters. School used to have them everywhere. As soon as things went to shit, I tore them all down. Stupid shit. Uh, could you? Uh, my hands all fucked up from messing with it all day. Stand back. Fucking shit. Dude, it you, doesn't work. You had one job. Fucking shit! I'll tell him to keep I'm trying. I'm sure you'll get it. Keep trying. It's not like I got all the time in the world to play scientist and figure this shit out. I'll figure it out. I just need more time. I'm alone trying, time. I'm trying to be nice, to Mitch. You are it. really I'll trying to be. alone. Thanks, though. For helping. At least it seems like our relationship's gotten a little bit better. Oh, lovely. <laughs> I have to wonder, I assume like being in the apocalypse after a while, your smell, your sense of smell, you just kind of dulls to everything and you don't really notice how bad it really smells. Do you think Sophie and Minnie might be with them when they get here? Uh, I don't know, maybe. I'm doing watch, Clem, for danger. Like patrol? No, Clem. Lookout's totally different than patrol. How so? You don't walk. Oh, right. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's talk to Lewis and see what's on his mind. <laughs> He's just like, boo, you suck. 
shit. What's going on? In a few weeks, or days, or hours, the raiders will be here. Burn down our place and steal or kill us. And then it won't matter how much I sucked at this. The raiders aren't gonna burn anything or steal anybody. We'll stop it. You sound like Marlin. I mean, not about fighting, but when he was trying to cheer us all up. For years, I sat around making stupid jokes, playing stupid games, while my best friend was left with all the responsibility, all the tough calls, all the sleepless nights, and eventually, a bullet in the head. And I didn't do a damn thing about it. And then when you tried to tell us what he was really like, and AJ shot him, I blamed you. Both of you. If I could take it back, I would. Oh. I knew that the day you got back. I, I still do. I forgive you. I understand why you did it. I'm not angry. He was my best friend, almost like my brother, but the things he did, they were fucked up. There we go. I'm glad he's seen me to come around on everything. Here. You take it. Watch it. Clementine will be amazing. Are you sure? I mean, it's Marlin's. Yeah, it was. And he used it to defend the school before... Before he stopped. Go ahead. Damn. Try Hell it. yeah. In <sighs> that direction, please. I have a feeling I'm going to be better at it than you are. <laughs> and just so you know... I'm totally laughing out loud when you miss. See, this is the this is the Lewis that I like. I think maybe if I have a chance, if if I have the option to go for him, maybe I will. Cause I feel like if there is the choice between Lewis or Violet, the majority of people will have gone for Violet just because she seems to be with a more popular character. So maybe I'll go the other way. I say Clementine could use a little bit of more like light in her life. Someone who's not as tough as she is, I guess. Okay, how long do I have to do this for? There we go. Damn. Remind me to never piss you off while I'm standing at a moderate distance with a big red circle painted on my chest. You want to come back and practice more? Just let me know. Okay? Sounds good. And Clem, thank you. For all of it. Place looks ready for a war. Back hallways secure. How is everyone? Okay, or, you know, a total fucking mess. <laughs> well, honestly, it's not perfect. I'm gonna be trying. honest. <laughs> they're doing everything they can. Trying is Lewis stop sucks at shooting. Uh, Mitch trying can't make bombs. isn't going to stop these raiders from burning down our fucking home. Jesus, Clem. They stopped giving out participation trophies when walkers started eating people. Because you're boring and your idea is stupid. Oh, I'm being stupid? You're the one who can't think straight. If you could hear yourself- Guys, what the fuck? Violet told us to work on the traps together, but a sim won't listen to anything I say. That doesn't mean you have to scream at each other. Stay out of this. I have an idea for duffel bags filled with bricks. We drop them on the raiders, if they get to the admin building. Willie here wants to use a giant, idiotic swinging log to take out one raider at most. It's completely stupid. You're stupid. You're being Ooh. childish. Damn I gotta that. say, the log I'm trap to help. worked so help well. And stop arguing. The swinging log sounds like it could do real damage. Yeah, that's what I said. Sorry, to, sorry, sure. Sim. Damage sorry. to like one person. If it manages to hit anyone at all. <sighs> that is I don't a good know why point, I'm surprised though. though. You know, I can't remember the last time Willie did anything useful for this school. You could barely handle guard duty. What the shit? Dude, you okay? Yeah, fine. Shit! Christ. We'll all kill each other before the raiders even get a fucking chance. Right, what we need is something to break the tension. Of course, that's the one thing, one good thing Lewis offers. Hey, buddy, how's it hanging? Dude. Fuck off. Sulking in the corner isn't gonna help us fight off the raiders. Or turn that frown upside down. You get more annoying every day. <laughs> Regardless, I've come up with a plan to make everybody feel better. 
And that plan is a game. Of course. That's all he has. All he has is the card Come game. Come on, we gotta play. Okay, I'm coming. Well, we haven't played a game in weeks since that night with Marlin. I mean... If you want to go ask Ruby to come play, I don't mind waiting. Shut up, dude! <laughs> Swear to God. You've got oh, a crush I... on Ruby? Aww. What are we playing? Truth or Dare. Oh, no. You don't use <laughs> cards in Truth or Dare. You do in this version. Everyone draws. Highest card gets to ask, lowest card has to answer. This could be fun. <laughs> this should be good. Let's see. Truth. Mary oh, fuck no. kill. Oh Bye. god. <laughs> Fine. Mary flip kill. Ruby, a sim, or James, that guy who saved you. Oh my god. You gotta answer. Them's the rules. Let's see. Oh no. I would Oh this marry... is so this is the toughest thing so far. Uh I would let's say I would marry Ruby. Because she's cool. Ruby. Watch out, Asim. She's totally gonna swoop in and ruin your dream. You gotta admit, Clem's a way better catch than you. I would, um, flip. Flip, 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 <laughs> flip, flip, flip. flip. <laughs> oh god, this is so awkward. I don't want to say I would kill Asim. Uh, but at the same time, I don't want to say that I would fuck Asim or flip, I'm sorry. Uh, let's say... Oh, God. I'll say... James. James. That's an interesting choice. <laughs> Funny. You pronounce horrifying differently than I do. <laughs> what can, can I say? say I'm into... Skin? I'm like into... Human skin? Maybe it clums into I it. I don't know. I wonder if you take it off to... Uh... You know what? Never mind. So that means you're killing... This is amazing. <laughs> A sim! Oh, thank God. What?! You'd rather die than marry or flip Clem. I, uh, no. I didn't mean it like that. This is great. We're laughing, we're bonding. Oh, that was it's a, a tough nice one. break from thinking about homicidal assholes sneaking into our homes to kidnap us. Well, you bring it up. Exactly. On to round two. Good job. Oh, you know he's gonna say something about Clementine. You know it. You know he still has a thing for her. I win. And poor Sim loses. Definitely a dare. Uh, okay. Do your worst. Oh, I'm gonna say ask Ruby for a kiss. You have to ask Ruby for a kiss. Seriously? The most legitimate of dares. Oh, Oh, no, please. Oh, please let her say yes. I think that would be cute. <laughs> 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 or not. <Damn. laughs> oh, I can't breathe. <laughs> Aww, I feel bad for him. I thought well, maybe she'd go for it. I think we it. all learned something about our good friend Asim today. That Mainly, I would kill that him. he has no romantic charm whatsoever. Shut up. Look sharp, y'all. It's time for round three. Of course. I got Lewis. it. We've been pretty hard on poor Asim here, teasing him about sweet Ruby. Seems only fair we mercilessly tease someone else about oh, unrequited no. love. Oh, he's gonna so, ask me. Clem. Anyone here you like like? Seriously? Like like? What I'll are say, you, six? I'll say Seven. definitely. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. I've definitely got feelings for someone. Oh, oh who is it? <laughs> nope. Not telling. Oh, I. she's hoping- oh man, maybe I'll swing over to Violet. I don't know, I don't know. She seems like she's got maybe a little a something Sam, for her too. You've got the high card, and the loser is Tennessee. Be nice to him. What's something you've never told anyone because you were afraid they'd make fun of you? You oh. got this. I, um, I, I think, I think walkers won't always be around. They'll go away someday, because the world goes in cycles, right? Ice Age, Stone Age, um, some other ages. So it's like that. This age will end. And look at him getting deep, man. An age without walkers, like it used to be. You had to. It'll be better. I was like, I can't tell if he brought it, brought Why us down. Why is looking or... at me like that? I'm gonna say that's beautiful. That's really beautiful. I never thought of it that way. 
Aw, Ten is just such a sweetheart, and I hope nothing bad happens to him. What's wrong, AJ? I... I just don't know what it's like. All of you do, but I don't. I don't remember a time before monsters. You know what, little dude? It's okay that you don't. Believe me, the world before this one was pretty shitty. Oh, Lewis, you're kind of... you're growing on me. Maybe, hey, yeah. That feels like a good place to call it. <laughs> we should finish up our work anyway. It's getting dark. Poor Sim. Definitely got the, the uh, yeah. short end of that Clementine's stick. Clementine's got it after me. <laughs> can I come? Oh, of course you can, little guy. Oh, I still think playing... Because oh, something's definitely going to happen to Ruby, and that, that makes me upset. Hey. Hey. You, uh, need any help with that log? Um, yeah, it's pretty heavy. Let's go build the deadliest log ever conceived by man. Yeah, Lewis, good job, man. Sorry I punched you. He's good okay. for something. It's a pretty good punch. I'm headed to the bell tower. I want to check out our defenses on the back wall before bed. Do you need help? Sure, if you want. You could always help me instead. Oh, no, I gotta I am on piano though. duty. <laughs> what? I gotta get in some practice before one of you decides to chop it into firewood. I've got a project I want to try, but I need a second person. I am intrigued by Lewis's thing, but I feel kind of useless. Oh, I am gonna get to choose! I am gonna get to choose. Alright, let's go with Lewis. Let's go with Lewis. Poor Violet. She probably thinks I'm just skirting work. She's like, oh yes, do your piano thing, Clementine. That's... Very useful. Well, that's kind of sweet, but I also feel like if I uh, potentially get into a relationship with someone, I may have just doomed them. And like I said, I feel like based on how the majority of people, you know, went with Violet in the first episode to defend them, Lewis is kind of the forgotten one, so I'm gonna go the other way. And, uh, you know... Also, he's grown on me. He wasn't crazy about him in the first episode, but... Just don't sing My Darling Clementine to me again, please. Thought I could tickle the ivories one last time before all hell breaks loose. That's a good idea. Haven't heard music in a while. Many people would say you're not about to hear it now. So, how do you feel about our imminent deaths? Wow, you are a smooth talker. We Lewis. won't necessarily <laughs> die, of course. We could also be kidnapped, injured, maimed, maybe eaten. The possibilities are endless. I'm keeping it together. You are romantic, Lewis. Easy, I gotta but the say alternative <laughs> is giving up, and I'm not doing that. Oh man, my whole give up plan is shot to hell. If you're not gonna, I definitely can't. So, what's this project you needed me for? Sounds awful, right? No, All wants... we need to do is tune it. That's why really? I need you. <sighs> Violet's thing seems way more practical to helping us out, but no, he wants me to tune a piano. That's when I going... give a signal, play the A key. That's going to be destroyed anyway. Uh, yeah, which one's the A key? You know, the A key. Next to the B key. After the G key. Now she seems to be enjoying herself. Have a little bit of levity before, you know, all hell breaks out. Good. That definitely helped. Now press the pedals while I make some more adjustments. Great. That part's golden. Quick, now blow on the strings. I know, sounds weird, but blow on them. Cooling the temperature helps set them in harmony. Okay, great. That did nothing, because that's not at all part of how you tune a piano. <laughs> God damn it, Lewis. But it was funny! I am kind of, It could have uh... done something, on like a molecular level. Or maybe oh, should it's I say you're the cutest? I will. <laughs> you are super cute. Cute? Wow, uh, that's, uh, yay! <laughs> I'm going for it, guys, Glad I'm going for it. You know what, if we might, if we might die tomorrow, or if people are gonna die, maybe him. 
I'm, I'm gonna stop being coy. What are you playing? And don't say a piano. A song that I wrote. Really? What's it called? I don't know yet. There. First time played. We should mark the occasion. Once again, he did say that this piano was going to be destroyed tomorrow, right? Oh god, he's so gonna die because we're marking it down and this is all very sweet and... You done tattooing that piano? But you know what, if he dies but Violet lives... I think you've got a future in Whitlin. I like saying Whitlin. Uh, Alright, you know what, like I said, I'm gonna stop playing coy, so let's do it. Oh, that's a... That, that's a potato? <laughs> it's a heart. Yep, I see. It's a heart. That's super cool. <laughs> really cool. So, hey, I'm gonna dig myself into a deep hole from which I'll never emerge. Cool? Cool. Huh. Time to get serious. Serious? Wow. You feeling okay? Not really, nope. Mm -mm. Thanks for being here. Listening. <laughs> Blowing on the strings. Coming here to help me with my project, even after everything I put you through. And everything I had to work through for myself. Everyone hears the jokes, the piano, and after that, they stop listening. You didn't. Okay, I think it's obvious, Clementine, that you like like him, but we'll say it anyway. So, um, I like you a lot. Like, like you. As more than a friend. As if the heart and saying that he was cute wasn't, you know, obvious <laughs> no enough. No jokes? Nothing? When you said you had feelings for someone during the game, I was hoping it was me. Oh. And it is. Holy shit, it's me! <laughs> Figured out what to call the song. Clementine, obviously. You know, because I like fruit. And I like you even more, so... There. Gotta admit, of all the things I saw coming, you having a crush on me was not it. Okay, we knew it was You're happening, guys. Stabbing me in my sleep. Yes. Declaration of crush. No. <laughs> I said he's super happy. She's happy, which means I have to go. Uh, I've got lookout duty. It's all gonna go to shit. Well, you wouldn't want to miss that. Sounds like way too much fun. Oh, that was cute. That was cute. I'm very curious of what violets would have been. I'm sure that would have been really sweet as well. The Raiders. That guy. He's gonna be with them. Abel. Yeah. Your bad dreams. They're all about him, aren't they? Well, I guess we gotta kill yeah. him so that AJ doesn't have any more bad dreams because I am a super protective mom. I fucking really mm -hmm. hate that fucking dickhead Whoa. shit. Fuck. Whoa. Whoa. That's a little much, don't you think? You know, he did try to kill us, so I don't think that it's really out of line. Well, I do. <laughs> Try thinking about something else. Count the monsters you see. Same number as before. Three, four... I'm just waiting. I'm waiting for something to happen. Hey, I know it's, it's coming. It's okay if Abel frightens you. You know how to control that. There's ten monsters out there. He doesn't frighten me. But when he comes here, I call dibs. Damn. I'm the one that kills him. Okay. Okay? Sure. Okay. Really? Yes, I can't promise you how things are gonna go. But if it's possible, you get first shot Once at again, him. I feel like I'm giving him conflicting wow. uh, thoughts about, what? you know, you don't, shoot, no? don't shoot people. Yeah. But also, I'm grown you, can, up now. you can shoot him. No, you aren't. But the I'm whole close. thing about, like, there are monsters, but monsters can be redeemed. But not him, he's a piece of shit, you can kill him. Clem, I see something. Not a walker? Here, you look too. Oh shit, yep. Oh, it's like the horse. Okay, I- can I- I- I can see the thing. I can- I can see it. Can I not? 
Yeah, it's right there. The horse, yes. I guess I have to follow where they're going. That's not a walker. <laughs> she was staring at it for Good like 30 seconds and she's like, yep, not a walker. Come on, we have to tell the others. Raiders? Yeah, they're here. Shit. Well, in case it all goes to hell and I don't see you again during the fight, just know, I have no idea what that D stands for on your hat. <laughs> don't tell me. I prefer it to remain a mystery. But I'm gonna pretend like it stands for don't die. So just, um, listen to your hat, okay? Same goes for you, Lewis. Don't We're die. They've got at least four more people, all carrying guns, and carts, probably to carry people away. Oh no! Assholes! I can't believe they're really here! If they get inside, I'll keep them focused on me. That should give Willie and Mitch time to set up the bomb. I'll set it under those carts. It'll work. I promise. If they manage to get in, we fall back. To the admin building. Exactly. Right into our traps. The log's ready. I double-checked it. Triple, even. So... Uh... Any final words of wisdom? Don't die. You've faced them in one, after all. <laughs> Try not to die. Well, sort of. I'm gonna say look out Lewis, for each other. Lewis, shut it. No matter what happens... Fuck! Shit! Well, it's okay. We, we don't know who Hi. that person now. is, so... Omar! I got it. Omar! Oh, no, Omar. Poor Omar. <laughs> Whose name I didn't know. I... I know. <laughs> Let me no! Open up, kid! This doesn't have to get any uglier! My bow! Go! Go! I'll be alright. You don't have much time! Go! Oh boy, this is gonna turn into a shooter. I am not good at it. Why? Alright. Oh, right there. go, 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 go. Why? Now I'm gonna have to. Oh god, I'm terrible at shooters, so we'll see how this goes. Well, that just screwed up our plans real quick. They just busted in no problem. I guess that was the plan. Okay. They said that they just want us to go try through. Not to move or make we, noise. We wanted them to go through the front, front gate so that we would funnel them in. But the fuck is all this? Focus. They just scarecrows. Guess they took us seriously. Spread out. Am I gonna get to nail her right in the fucking head? Lily! Move and I'll shoot! You won't get the chance! Where's our new recruits? <laughs> They're not yours! Search the yard. Oh shit, Ten. <gasps> Don't you touch him, precious if Clementine boy. Clementine moves, shoot her. Damn, she is so harsh. We'll find them, Clementine. Oh my god, I can just we'll kill take her? Them. Damn. And you. And your little boy. I don't think you want to kill me. Just like you didn't want to in the woods. Shut up! I can just kill her if I want to, but... Can't fucking do it. Can I'm, you? I'm trying to keep it, like, loosey-goosey, loosey-goosey, and try not to set off You've everybody. Changed. I grew up. I can see that. God, you are just like him. Lee would have been heartbroken knowing he taught you all the wrong things. Don't you talk about me. That the sweet yeah. little girl he protected turned out like this. You're right, Lily. I am just like him. And if he saw me now, he'd be proud of who I am. Why? Because you pick fights you can't win? Right. I'm sure that made all his sacrifices worth it. Get out! If you won't help me find the others, I'll find someone who will. James! We recruited from this James. school before. 
Or, no, the sisters. The sisters, Minnie right? wanted to come oh. along tonight to tell you how well she's adjusted to her life. How happy she is. She said she had a girlfriend back here. Friends she missed. One guy who could always make her laugh no matter what. God damn it. I should have killed and her. And her little brother. She missed him the most. <gasps> Dude, no! Shit! Where are they? Let me take you to them. I can. I just want them back. Please. Don't listen to her, Ten. You know she's lying. She stole your sisters. She took them away from you. From their home. <sighs> Shit. Oh, I should have just shot her. Now, Ten. There we go. There we go. I feel like I'm gonna have to kill her, aren't I? Come on, Ten. Come on. Come on, buddy. Go, Mitch. Yes, redeem yourself. Go, buddy. Go. Oh! Well. God damn it. Well, okay. I mean. Mitch! Okay. Okay, so, Mitch. I mean, not. Not the way I wanted it to go, but... Kill who you have to! Take the rest! Of the majority of the characters, is the one that I don't think I would use very much. This all went to hell in a handbag. Now, go back! Follow them! God damn, Clementine, you are badass. Mitch was a necessary sacrifice. Thank you for your services. I'm glad it wasn't Ruby, but I know it's not over yet. And please don't be Lewis or Violet or Ten. I know there's probably gonna be at least one more person who dies because it always has to end on a shock, you know, some sort of shocking death or something's gonna happen. We'll probably be captured and then we're gonna go back to their, to their camp or whatever. Starting to regret the. I hope this will take out a lot of people. No! Ah, <sighs> it was like a. Uh, Kill that one, the girl. It was like he said. It was. It only took out one person. I wonder if the bricks would have done more damage. Oh shit, I'm separated from AJ. Go, no, 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 let's go, there we go. AJ, the door! Lock it! Ah, god damn it, AJ. Friend Lily ain't around this time, so we'll have a nice little chat. You and me, alone. X. Ah, fuck it, bitch! What'd you think was gonna happen? Um, I can't. Stay back! God damn it. Ah. Uh, go, 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 go! Wait, 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 why am I not grabbing it? Oh, shit! Whenever I see someone like you, weak, small, afraid, and still alive, well, let a lot of folks die to get you here. Okay, grab it this time, there we go. Uh, X! Oh, ho, 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 ho. Also, I see what I did wrong. I pressed the wrong button last time. Go, AJ! Hell yeah! And like you said, you get the last crack at it, my boy. Good job. Dibs. Good job, murder, murder son. Kick him out that window. Go. Go. I know you said dibs, but... Come on, AJ. Come on, buddy. I give you permission. You can kill this one. No redeeming this monster. Oh shit. Ah shit. AJ, you said divs, man, and then you you froze up. Oh. oh, I wonder if Clem's gonna be the only one who gets captured. 
Oh, ho, 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 Shit, this should be easy. I'll see you in hell. You'll be there for a good long time before I show up. I don't mind waiting. I had to give one last, like, badass one-liner. Oh! Whoa. Yes, Violet! Oh shit, Violet's gonna die. Oh, don't, no, don't kill Violet. Oh no, oh no. Oh, maybe I doomed Violet because I went with Lewis? Yes, Rosie! Fuck yeah, Rosie! Yes! Good girl, good girl. Shit. Oh, they got Violet. Shit. Shit. Save- oh god. Save Violet. I'm gonna get Lewis killed, aren't I? Shit. We cut our fall back! Pull in and fall back! I feel bad. I just told him I like them, but let's be honest, if one of them has to get captured, you know, Violet will be a much better person to have with me, you know, for the incoming fight. So how many people did they get? Oh no, here we go. Alright. getting eaten by a walker who's already, like, on fire. Okay, that didn't go so well. <laughs> okay, gotta worry, just aim for the head! Oh my god! Oh my god! This is so bad! <laughs> Go figure, when they're far away I can hit them no problem. No, oh, don't make me do more. You're making me do more, damn it. Okay, why can't I... Shit. Oh, it's not letting me... Oh, there we go. Shit. Oh, God. Oh, it's slowing down now. Oh, shit. There we go. Where's the other one? 
When you hear the zombies in your ears when you've got the headphones in, it really... It's hard to, to stay calm. Oh, God. Oh, boy. Okay, so we lost Lewis. I think we lost 10. I don't know who else was taken. Whew, 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 whew. That was intense. My, my heart is pounding. Oh god. Okay, Ten's still here. Rosie. Sweet Rosie. Oh, you did good, girl. Clem. I... I'm sorry. For trusting her. You fucked it all up, Ten, but I forgive you because you're, you're a good dude. Oh. They took them. Sim and Omar and... God damn it, Lewis! I know. We're going after them. If we knew where to look, I'd smash down their walls myself. But we don't. Well, we've got someone who does. Oh, right, he's still alive. Ha ha ha. Oh, your leg is fucked <sighs> up. <laughs> Alright, AJ, don't screw this up. I don't want this to end with we're about to, like, ask him, like, Alright, where are they? And then AJ shoots him in the head. And he'd be like, you said dibs. <sighs> okay, I'm glad it didn't end that way. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, so there we go, guys. Episode 2 is done. Tell me where that wasn't did you sleep? All right, Mitch, dead. Mitch was surprised when you admitted AJ was wrong to kill Marlin. Mitch was irritated when he decided to help Ruby bury the walker. So yeah, I could have killed Lily. I wonder what it would have happened if I had. You left Violet feeling vengeful. Violet was relieved when you and AJ returned to the school. Violet was disappointed you chose to spend time with Louis instead of her. Yeah, so I could have... Could have uh, romanced her instead, but... You left Ten feeling despondent. Ten was thoughtful when you said people need to make new rules. Ten felt hopeful after sharing his belief that the Walker age will end someday. Abel captured. Abel was aggravated when you warned Violet and Lewis to run in the forest. Abel was impressed when you taunted Lily with shooting with you. I don't give a shit what Abel says. You left Lily feeling unconvinced. Lily was grateful you remembered her. Lily was pleased when you accepted her help to stand. And then she turned to a total bitch every time after that. You allowed Louis to be kidnapped. I am a terrible... I mean, I, we're not boyfriend-girlfriend, but like... It's kind of a dick move on my part. Lewis was comforted when you said you were sorry you and AJ hurt him. Lewis was astonished when you confessed you had feelings for him. Lewis felt betrayed when you allowed him to be taken after spending time together. Once again, I let Lewis be taken because Violet will be a better person to have when we go after you. Uh, you left AJ feeling repentant. AJ was soothed after sleeping in your bed. He was satisfied after he got dibs on killing people. Another thing too is... Violet is kind of like the leader of the group, so it makes more sense to not let the leader get captured, right? You left Ruby feeling grateful. Ruby was distraught when AJ took responsibility for killing Marlin. Ruby was consoled when you expressed sympathy over finding the school nurse. You left James feeling trusted. James felt helpful when you let him feed AJ the apple. James was attentive when you said you were originally from Georgia. Alright, state of the school. Omar, kidnapped. Rosie was loyal to you after you petted her in the courtyard. Ooh, so if I hadn't pet her, would she have just let me... Like, she wouldn't have stepped in to help? Seem kidnapped. Poor Seem, not having a great time. He got rejected 
by Ruby. I said that I would kill him, and then he's been kidnapped. Oh, I missed a... I don't know what that... Oh, I could have got another skull. Damn it. Oh, well. All right, guys, and that will do it for episode two of The Walking Dead. I hope you enjoyed it this season, continuing on, on, like, being a very strong and really good season. Uh, it makes me all the more happy that they are going to finish it. How upsetting would that have been if that's how it got left off? And that was the reason why I didn't want to play it for the longest time, because I didn't want it to just end on a cliffhanger knowing that there was going to be no resolution to it. So now that we know that there will be an ending, I am super excited about episode three. Hopefully we will be getting some news about it soon. And when it does, you guys know I will be playing it <laughs> a lot sooner than I have with this one. So I hope you guys enjoyed uh, this Let's Play, and I hope to catch you in the next one. Until next time, bye guys.